Welcome to the winner's area here at Hollywood Bet's Gravel Race Course after the running of race number six, which was won by a few dollars more from the Glen Cotson Yard. And this was ridden by Cole Dickon. Well done to John Buckley and the entire team here in KZN. And the groom, his name is Mzikaise, and he receives a thousand rand on behalf of Gold Circle and Hollywood Bet's. Well done to you, sir. Congratulations. Fantastic. OK, we're going to get the winning conditioner in. He's going to tell us more about uh, this individual. If you draw a line through that run on the 8th of November, ever since he stepped up in KZN, he's been running really well. Yeah, he's, uh, obviously his last run, you've got to be, I think, three and a half lengths. His first run out of the maiden plates. I think the 14 was a bit too short for him. Uh, he didn't travel on the grass as easy as he does on the poly. So I think yes. he's, to me, I think he's a better poly on the grass at the moment. Um, just well done to Glenn, to Stephen, to Higgs and Jigs. And to all others concerned, thank you for the support. And to Hilton and World Sports Betting, thank you very much. At first glance, uh, John, the form doesn't jump out at you, but when you dig deep, his runs on the poly track have been very good. And I saw him in the parade ring. I must commend you. He was beautifully turned out. I said, I must keep an eye on how this horse goes down to the start. He just floats on the poly track. Yeah, he's, he's doing well at the moment here. I can't complain. Um, like I say, well done to Carl. Thank you very much for, for a nice ride. And to everyone concerned, and to all our owners, uh, thank you very much. One more left. Can we see you back here? Yeah, she's a filly, just won a maiden plate fair trip. Um, small, smallish field, so it's hard to judge on a first run, you know. We'll see how she goes today. All the best with that. Thank you very much. Great stuff chatting to John there. They're doing a fast, fantastic job here in KZN. We're going to chat to Cole Dickon. This was a top-class ride, I must say. I oh, know, definitely. Everything worked out in my favour, really. I was a bit nervous out the gate when he jumped out and he had his head tucked right down. <laughs> it got me a little nervous, but pulled through very, very nicely, ran a cracker race, and he just kept going. After, even after the line, he just took me to the July start. <laughs> so I think we actually can go further with him. He definitely enjoys the distance. Can he be a little bit difficult sometimes? Not really, I wouldn't say. He, he's a very calm horse. He's, he's, I've never had a problem with him, really. Lovely stuff. I thought it was a great ride from you, the way he quickened up. And if I'm not mistaken, you got one more left in the last. I thought that had a chance. Uh, yes, Angelic Ford. If she overcomes the draw, she's a big run in the race. You're riding exceptionally well, Cole. Keep it up and all the best. Yeah, thank you. Uh, thank you to John for the, the help and support and to Glenn for allowing me to, him to put on to all the owners. Congratulations on the horse. And I know they almost got rid of him. <laughs> so he's I'm very... A, he's got a new lease on life on the poly track here. <laughs> oh, no, definitely. And we can go further. So it opens up a lot of opportunity. Uh, congratulations to the owners and my sponsors winning form. Thank you. Well done, Cole. Thank you. Great stuff there, chatting to the winning rider, Cole Dickon, aboard number six, few dollars more. Well done to Glenn Cotts and his entire team, John Buckler. And this was bred by Ten Ainda Farm, the owners, Messias G.R.L. Manza, M.C. Higgs, J.R. Higgs, G.S. Cotson, Eric Wong, S.L. Russo and Miss Natasha C. Pretorius. Well done to all the winning connections there of number six, few dollars more.